this is Mary with All Things Automotive, bringing you here today a 2022 Tesla Model 3 Long Range. This vehicle features an electric engine with all-wheel drive. The Long Range version of the Tesla Model 3 does exactly what its name suggests. It has an upgraded battery, meaning you can go farther without charging. This particular vehicle has no accidents or damages reported to Carfax, and it is a Carfax certified one owner vehicle as well. As we get closer here to the front of it, you'll be able to see that it is a sleek multi-coat red with chrome and black accents as you'll be able to see there on that front emblem as well as down around those fog lights. Those fog lights will help you out in inclement weather and speaking of inclement weather, we'll come along here to the side and take a look at this vehicle's tires and wheels. This vehicle features 18 inch dark gray aluminum alloy wheels and as for the tire treads, you have got a significant amount of life left in them but I'll get you those exact measurements in just a second as this vehicle, along with all the other vehicles here at All Things Automotive, has undergone a new multi-point inspection as well as received a brake caliper service. Right behind that wheel, you do have a right side camera to help you whenever you're backing up or parking. And this vehicle also comes with a sentry mode camera to the right and to the left of the vehicle to help protect it against any unwanted incidents. We'll now take a look here to the inside of the vehicle. Here on the inside of the vehicle, you'll be able to see you do have a lovely jet black leatherette upholstery for a nice and easy cleanup after any spills or messes. And it also really gives it a chic and sleek appearance. You also have some lovely faux wood trim all along the dashboard and along the doors. And while we're looking inside here, I'll just get out the results of that multi-point inspection that I was talking about. As you'll be able to see on this, you do have green checks the entire way around. And as for your tire treads, you have 10 30 seconds in both the front tires and 8 30 seconds in both the rear tires. And as for your brake pads, you have 12 30 seconds in the front and 11 30 seconds in the rear. So you have a long ways to go before you need to replace any of those. We'll now continue around here to take a look at the rear occupant seating. As you'll be able to see back here, this vehicle does seat a total of five people. But if you have four or less, this middle seat does fold down to become an additional armrest with two cup holders in it. You also have charging ports back here for these rear occupants mobile devices as well as pockets on the backs of both of those front seats. And down on the floor, you do have carpeted floor mats to help keep it nice and clean. All of the doors do have several storage spaces in them as well as powered windows. And we'll continue around to take a look here at the rear of the vehicle. All along the bumper back here, you do have rear proximity sensors and you also have them in the front. That's what those little dots are. They will let you know if there's anything behind you whenever you're backing up or parking. And you also have a backup camera to go along with that. And as I mentioned before, you also have a right side camera and a left side camera. I'll just pop open the tailgate so you can see how much space you have. And as you'll be able to see, it does go up with the push of a button as it is powered. All right, as you'll be able to see back here, you do have a lot of space to haul some pretty significant loads. And those seats in front do fold down to give you even more space. Underneath the floorboards, you do have a space back here. And this vehicle also comes with its charging cord as well. I'll just put that tailgate back down. And we'll continue around to the driver's side. I would like to mention that with the purchase of this vehicle, you do get two keys for your convenience and to help prevent you from ever getting locked out. And the last thing I would like to show you before I get in the vehicle and turn it on for you is just by popping open that front trunk and showing you that you do have a space in here as well. You have the driver's side, left side camera, as well as a driver's side sentry mode camera. And now I will just get in the vehicle and turn it on for you. Here on the inside of the vehicle, behind the left side of the steering wheel is your windshield wipers and turn signals, and behind the right side of your steering wheel is your gear shift and cruise control. And in order to turn this vehicle on, all you need to do is depress the brake and put your key card right here. And just like that, that electric motor will turn on smoothly and easily. As you may have already noticed, this vehicle does come with built-in navigation. And I'll just pull up the software, and you'll be able to see that this vehicle does have the software version 11.1. It does have the full self-driving computer. And this vehicle also has about 44,846 miles on it. 
So a question almost everybody has with electric vehicles is how far is this going to go on a full battery? As you'll be able to see when this is fully charged, you'll be able to go about 335 miles on it. The standard version of the Model 3 can go about 272 miles on it. So with this long range version of it, you can expect to go about 60 to 70 miles farther than the standard version. This car does come with a heated driver seat, a heated passenger seat, and a heated steering wheel to help keep you warm in the winter. And now I'll just throw it in reverse to show you all three of those cameras in action. I'll also just put it in neutral here so you can see that it already does recognize those cars outside through the glass. Underneath that central display, you do have two wireless smartphone chargers if your smartphone is compatible, a large storage compartment behind that, two cup holders farther back, and then your main storage compartment with another power outlet inside. Lastly, we'll take a look up at the ceiling, as this vehicle does come with a tinted panoramic glass roof to really enjoy those sunny summer days. We'll now move on to the last section of this video. In the last section of this video, we do want to address that this vehicle is pre-owned, so we'll be looking around for any blemishes, nicks, or stains. We know a lot of our customers come from very far away, so we want to be as transparent as we can be with the purchasing process. We want you to know exactly what you're getting with the purchase of this vehicle, imperfections, and all. So as I'm looking around the inside of the vehicle, I do notice you have some slight staining there on the top of that driver's side visor. But other than that, nothing significant is really standing out to me. There are no odors or scents whatsoever. So I'll move along to take a look here at the outside of this vehicle. We'll be looking up and down again for any of those imperfections. We do have some scratches by that driver's side sensor camera. And we'll make our way around here to the front of the vehicle. Here along the front, we do have several small nicks, most likely from stone chipping. Stone chipping is extremely common. Almost every vehicle has some form of it. The only way you can really prevent stone chipping is just by not driving your vehicle. We'll come along here now to the passenger side. A scuff there. And some scuffing here on that black plastic of the mirror cap. Nice scuff there as well. we'll come along here now to the rear of the vehicle. Now often where I do tend to see several imperfections is where the tailgate meets the bumpers. People don't take care of putting items in and taking items out. And as I look here, that is the case for this vehicle. You do have some wearing and nicking on this black plastic and on that bumper as well. I'll just put that tailgate back down and we'll continue around back to the driver's side. And we are back to where we started. That generally concludes this video vehicle tour. This vehicle has a lot of great features to offer. If you're interested in a red mid-sized car with a full self-driving computer, the ability to seat five fold-down seats with a good amount of space in the rear, a left side, right side, and rear backup cameras, a powered tailgate, carpeted floor mats, sentry mode cameras, built-in navigation, a wireless smartphone charger, heated front seats with a heated steering wheel, a panoramic glass roof, two keys, an electric motor, and an extended battery life, this is a good option for you. If you're interested in this vehicle, come and check it out at All Things Automotive. Located at 21518 Great Cove Road, McConnellsburg, PA. Or you can give us a call at 717-485-4224. You can also check out this mid-sized car and other listings on our website at www.allthingsautomotive.com. Thank you for watching this video and have a great day.